The Accra Methodist Church Diocese on February 11th donated some school chairs to the Accra Wesley Girls High School. The donation, spearheaded by Right Reverend Kofi Osabote, the Bishop of Accra, saw to this donation. The Methodist Church, since its establishment in Ghana, have built several schools from primary to university, increasing the pace of education. With education and eradicating poverty as part of the Millennium Development Goals, several NGOs and churches have partnered with government to help build schools, renovate and reinstate old ones. The Methodist Church has several schools to its name across the country. Speaking to the dignitaries and students present at the occasion, Right Reverend Kofi Osabote stated the government is not the only body that can help improve education, but other institutions such as the church are likely responsible. Uh, Methodist Church Ghana. This is Methodist Church of Ghana, of which Accra Wesley Girls High School was built under Accra Diocese. Now, in the beginning of the time, we realized their needs, including decks for learning in their classrooms. They need about 500, and Accra Diocese decided to donate 200, and what we presented today is 100 of it. We believe we would bring the rest. We have donated computers already. Together with the government, we seek to provide all their needs. Education is essential to a country's development. Ghana, in its struggle to develop, have set up several measures to ensure every child have a privilege to education. Last year, over 173 senior high schools were built and over 30 renovated as part of the 200 community school project promised by the government in 2012. Last election saw how much Ghanaians valued education as most citizens, especially mothers, bought into the idea of free senior high school. The school belongs to the Methodist Church Ghana, being overseen by the Accra Diocese of the Methodist Church Ghana. It's one of our flagship schools, uh, modeled after the famous Wesley Girls you know, High School. So we thought that from time to time, we should find out the needs of the school. At the beginning of the academic year, we had a very large intake and realized that they had challenges with their decks you know, for teaching and learning. So the Accra Diocese, out of its normal grants and allocations to the school, decided to come to the aid of the school by producing 200 monodex. The first 100 is what we are presenting today. The remaining 100 will follow. And they are expecting 500 you know, decks, but the Accra Diocese is supplying 200 you know, monodex for teaching and learning. Apparently, the education system is quite flexible financially for government schools, for the primary and JHS, but quite expensive for the senior high schools. The number of students last year who wrote BC was 438,030, of which only 50% passed due to several factors. However, enrollment of students into senior high school saw only 60% of those that passed, showing the high disparity between junior high school and senior high school. Most government schools don't have the capacity for more students, and with high cost of educating in private schools, Parents are unable to send their children to senior high schools that are private.